I'll live for today Still unhappy But here I'll stay the back. 
What's up? What is up? We are uh, we're doing it today. We are on Zonvort, Zonvort, Vort, Vort. I'm sure there's a crazy way to say it wherever that word even originates from. Uh, anyway, that's where we're at. Uh, it's gonna be a good time. We've already got a few on track. We have Smoke in here, Mr. Fast Smoke, uh, Mr. Uh, Wittavine. Thank you for joining us again today. I appreciate that. Knutson's on the track. So is Cooper. Thank you guys so much. Knutson, what's up here in chat? Also, hi, sm small town. How are you today, buddy? But yeah, we are on Zonvort today, and uh, it's going to be a good time. I'm excited to uh, get the Nissan. I'm, I'm actually, every day, I'm excited to get the Nissan on a different track. That's uh, it's got me got me thrilled to be driving a different vehicle. Uh, and there is eight minutes of qualifying left. So if you haven't yet, make sure to pop in to the server there is 32 spots on the server so there is plenty of room for everybody and zonvort is a base game so there's that too how much to it it's base game you can just jump in sweet but i'm gonna get my laps in nice and early today get my uh got my setup loaded that i've been kind of using across that i've been kind of using across uh um, take care there's a car approaching okay casey we've got across seven all the minutes to get a decent lap in blue flag oh i, I was like why is my game feel a little different i turned down the uh i turned down the game because i was in the jaguar the jaguar i was like why does it feel so different let's go up to like 85 yellow flag Drive. Uh, what's up, Jay? He says, yo, Casey, uh, chat, hope all is good. I'll jump in on the next one for sure. I believe we'll probably, we'll probably do three races on Zonvort today. Already six on track. If you guys want, head over to uh, Discord announcements tab. And that's where you will find uh, the information you need to join today's server. Oh, Pierre, you saw my the NASCAR uh, truck race short that I posted. Yeah, that was, uh, I thought that was pretty funny. Cracked me up yesterday. I wrecked a car in iRacing, and Jim asked me if I was okay. Very sweet of him. Slippy 
here on Line 4 right now. Let's we'll see if I can... I need to set up, turn up TC just a little bit here. Keep going though, we'll see what tire pressures are. What they're looking like. Getting used to the Nissan, Bobby. That's uh, fun. To I actually minutes. like it a lot. It's a totally different experience than the Ferrari. It's like almost feels polar opposite, but maybe there's a car that's further opposite from the Ferrari. Uh, but I do like it a lot. I do like it a lot. is protesting as I have the door shut in here to hold in the cool air and Trip is protesting. He's banging on the door right now. Trip the cat protesting. Um, I don't know where that how far that's gonna get him but the problem is he doesn't is it's not that he wants in he just doesn't like closed doors. If you open the door he'll come in just to look at you and then walk back out. But if he comes in and you close the door he'll whine about that too so he's he's very hard to please. He just doesn't like closed doors. Very weird. All right, Casey. Ten minutes of fuel Definitely remaining. one of my favorite looking cars too, Bobby. That's why. That's why I went for it. I was like, you know what? I'm going to drive this because I like the way it looks. I still have to put down a valid lap. What's up, Mank? We are on Zonport today if you'd like to join. Oh, I see you're already in here. Good to have you on track, buddy. What's up, Strange Love?
just joined. Don't know the track. Uh, 50 laps. We've not done 50 laps. I don't know if I've done 50 laps on one. And the guy behind has just done a 141.36. Well, I don't have my track medals here. This is one of the few. gets so fast through the straights that it's a little bit different than my previous car I was in the Ferrari. Up a tenth there. That was good. of this lap. Hey, what's up, that beard? Hope you have time to join us today. Already got nine out here on track. Excellent. Okay, cut a second in. Uh, 1.2 off. Not bad. It worked today, unfortunately. That is all right. That's the end of the session. Mm -hmm. Five. So, here's the here's the scoop. So I wasn't I wasn't actually going to uh, going to stream today, but Matthew Bird, Matthew Bird, not Matthew Beard, he posted in um, he posted in Discord that he was he's like, what's 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 on the agenda for tomorrow? What track? I'm finally off work and I get to join. So I was like, oh, shoot. Well, I'll, I'll go ahead and stream, but uh, I also have a prediction. I hope he's not in here yet, because we want to see if we're right. I also have a pr prediction. I've never found anything that Matthew Bird likes. So I'm interested to see if when he comes in, he goes, oh, or so, if he has something to say about it, he doesn't like the track. I've never seen him, uh, I've never seen him like anything. You choose a car or a track, the dude's always like, track sucks. The track temp is so it'll be a fun social experience to see if... Uh, Celsius. See when Mr. Bird comes in here, if he's feeling it. Uh, what's up? I was here uh, from your first video. Oh, Dylan, what's up? Are you looking into getting you a CSL DD or a direct drive wheel in general? I know Fanatec's in a different place than they were whenever I made that video. Uh, it was a... Uh, yeah, it was. Uh, they were popping off when I bought it, and then uh, a week after I bought it, they had the whole shipping debacle, and now they've got the CEO being let go, and I don't know. I don't know where Fanatec's at right now, um, but I do know a lot of people are not buying their products right now, just in in worry of like customer support and stuff. I just got a ready to race bundle. Sweet. Uh, how's the tracking info look for you? Because regardless, the product's good. There's no. Oh shoot. No no no. Back back back. I gotta put in fuel. Oh no, no. Ah, oh, you can't. Can I? How do I? Follow car number 31. Dang it, I'm gonna have to drive this shoot. Um, yeah, now, now that's not to say there's anything wrong with the ready to race bundle. I think if your shipping goes off fine, you're you're in the clear because the, the it's uh let's see, it's decent but it's so much fun. Yeah, you're gonna have a good time, I promise. It's gonna be good. You know. Great. 
Left side, clear left. I gotta go do a fuel stop. Have to. Do I not have a... Can I not add fuel on the first? That sucks. Wow, what a waste of time that was. That's kind of dumb. Yellow flag, your rear brakes are cold. Oh, that's so stupid. I learned something new about this game every single freaking day, I swear. Some of the things I don't like. <laughs> See, do you have a clutch kit? Uh, yes, there is a clutch to the left of my, uh, to the left of that brake pedal. I'm on Houston Fold Sprints now. Is open now though, thanks. <laughs> Ten minutes of fuel remaining. You like my you like my socks? Gonna, we're gonna fit. I don't even know what I'm doing here. I messed up this race really bad. Watch your speed. Didn't add enough fuel. I like how dark and mysterious the pedal cam is. I know my legs, but I don't have a place to put this light. This light right here to light a bolt up. So, uh, you know. Yeah, it's a little dark and spooky. Plus, it's kind of stormy out right now, so the sun's not coming out. I kind of rely on the sun to light up my feet. Yeah, I've got... <laughs> I didn't realize what this sucks. So. They kind of look like they say drift. <laughs> All right. Let's get this race underway. Oh, good for me. Okay. Good old classic underfuel. Up says he was P5 in a split two at a wet Monza, and he underfueled by one lap, got last place. Oh, that's the worst. Jeez. behind me a lap down. The focus isn't there though. I have a hard time in racing games when I get put this far out in a race. 
I, uh, and especially in a 20 minute, my, my brain checks out. I don't, I actually race a lot worse. Okay, Casey, 15 minutes left. That's 15 minutes. I guess I could pull out the endurance mindset, but, uh, with 14 minutes in a race, it's hard to do. Center says professional sim racing streamer. Unfortunately, the uh, the thing you saw me do, pitting and trying to get fuel off the back because I missed it, I think streamers are more susceptible to, even if they are at a professional level, just because the distraction of running the stream, stuff like that. Yes, it is an official sock policy here. If you're talking about mismatched socks, strange love, that is a is a must. If we ever do a team race in the future, you will uh, have to wear mismatched socks. Part of what gives us our speed. turn right there is my least favorite on Zon board. It's, uh, it's a weird turn. There's lots of runoff to go fast, but it's very slippy and has to have a huge slowdown. Gotta keep people guessing, that's right. I have a good merch idea. We could have, uh, thank you, Socket to him, thank you. Uh, we could have everybody in the community send send in their uh, wash them first, please. Uh, send in all those, those lonely socks you find around your house that don't have a pair, and I'll just put them all in a giant box and I'll pair them up and we'll sell them as Road to Racer socks, and that'll be the thing. We'll sell uh, mismatched pairs of socks. Used by Sim Racers. Kind of a Kind of a nasty business idea, but you know, it all comes, uh, it all starts with spitballing, you know, brainstorming. That's where every business idea starts. Uh, I don't think this one's gonna take. Sounds like an OnlyFans thing. Yeah, I think so. I think so. Time. 
minutes to go. That's ten minutes left. Nice and smooth. Don't overdrive the car. That's half distance. You're looking good for fuel. Socks on OnlyFans. Uh, Wilson, possibly me. Possibly me. I actually need a sock donation. You guys all send me socks. Maybe I can find some matching pairs to wear on the screen. Everybody, I'll drop my, my address and everybody can send me a pair of socks. tuning in today's daily race is on zonboard we're going to do a couple to a few more of these and uh, there's already 12 on track there's 32 slots available in here so feel free to come in just head over to discord and go to the announcements tab and that's where you'll uh, get the server name and the password you know the drill and if you didn't now you do Holes? Uh, I prefer not. I do have a couple holy socks that I just haven't thrown away yet. But every time I put them on, I'm like, ah, oh, damn. And then uh, at the end of the day, I throw them in the dirty clothes, not even thinking about it. So, yeah, they never get, never get rid of them. My feet are size 13 as well, Matt Beard. We're good. You're perfect. The perfect fit. 13s. I saw some smoke on the ground, or some dust coming off the ground. That means there's a car. Oh, sweet civilization. Oh, finally. Finally see a car. It's Mr. Ben. Clear left. Clear left. Good race, Ben. I'm on my way. But that wasn't Ben. That was Zamorai. Ben is still subbing up. That was Zamorai. Ben, I'm on my way. I see you. Oh, guys, the Claire poster comes in today. Also, Jeff gets his uh, little GT Neo wheel or whatever it's called. I was looking it up last night. Oh, that wheel's sexy. A good looking wheel, Jeff. Chuck, I'm ready to see it. Will you have it by stream? And will it be hooked up and ready to go by stream? I guess that's the next question. Okay, Casey, gaining on this car. 
is 5.8 seconds. Five minutes to go. Five oh, look at my exit speed there. Oh, God. Oh, one shot, your GT Neo's been delivered today as well. Ah, uh, you and Jeff both. That's gonna be exciting. Now, have you been able to use your, um, is it Sim? I can't remember, is it Sim Magic? No, it's not, it's, uh, what's the name of the brand? Have you been able to use your base or have you been waiting on the wheel? Like Jeff, did you already have a wheel with your base? Oh, they are right behind me. Oh my right, gosh. Push down. Yeah, they are Catch freaking up fast here. I fueled. I had to stop for a refuel, and as a uh, as a punishment, Knutson is right there. No, Ben, no. Keep it together. Sector 2 is yellow. Looks like P4 has gone off. Green flag in Sector 2. and get him. I could have held him up, would have been. I guess I could have. Maybe I should have made it more interesting for Knudsen and you. The gap in front is now 0.36. Front brakes are getting a bit hot. Thank you. Come on, Casey. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Nicely done. New wheel goes directly into your Moza R9. Very nice. Oh, I bet you're excited, dude. That's two minutes left. Two minutes. have to watch the uh, relative down there and see what kind of time Knudsen puts down in this lap. I'm sure it's ridiculous. Puts down a 130, Knudsen put down a 136. Almost flat. My 
next race I'll try to put in enough fuel so I can uh, race alongside others. Everyone might be a little faster than me here, but what am I? Uh, I closed in on some of them. I think for the most part, everybody's. Uh, those next four in front of me are. Oh, I'm already in fifth. I was missing it all. Give me the firework. B5, that's the end of the race. Never mind. Watch me fly. Nice. We did it. Oh my god, my eyes so itchy. Why? Casey. Your suspension's completely knackered. There's nothing we can do. Trees there. outside have lots of lots of buds and pollen and all what all that allergy stuff I'm feeling it ah strange love no we can't good race after you added fuel yeah I did an extra drive through in there as well yeah I, apparently not everybody had a great race because I still come in fifth place which is insane not 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 not, not great uh, let's go back to garage. Uh, our leaders, we had Knutson, Wittavine, and Cooper. Uh, what are the timetables we got here, Cooper? Cooper's running uh 137 is a is a low lap 137 flat. Ooh, look at this. Cooper didn't invalidate one time. See that? Look at the consistency on Cooper here. Look at this. Right, right. I think you've got a, 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 a 105 in you, Cooper. You cut a couple corners. I bet you get a 105. <laughs> yep, yep. Guys, there are, um, looking at it here, there are air. Uh, guys, there are 20 slots left in here. If you want to jump on, don't be afraid. I see M, M Bine, Bean. Bian uh, has a rookie. Or he has the little rookie tag. Don't be afraid to get in here. You are more than welcome. Uh, just, you know, do your best. Be predictable. Uh, and get some practice with uh, some faster cars. Watch people's lines. Get used to uh, maneuvering around them. Or letting them maneuver past you. Whatever. Don't be afraid to get in here. Matthew Bird, I was telling everybody earlier that um, I wasn't going to stream today till I saw your post. And I was like, okay, we'll, uh, we'll, we'll do a stream today. We'll do a stream. Mr. Bird. What track tomorrow? Jeff, are we doing a, if Jeff is still in here, I'll ask. Jeff, are we doing a joint stream tomorrow? I believe it, tomorrow is a, uh, practice for the, um, it's a test run for the the Sim Cafe's, uh, whatever cup, the uh, you know the cup championship cup cup champ thing that they're doing over there. So yeah, yeah. Oh boy, I have to be on my emails today. I'm uh, doing a little bit of a little bit of work stuff today. Excuse me while I email check. I love this track too. Oh, Matthew Bird. You know what? Okay, I went. I was in the wrong. I was predicting what you would say when you got on. I told them that I was doing the stream because you said you were you had the day off, and then I told them. But I predict he's gonna come on here and say that he hates this track because I've never found anything that Matthew Bird likes. <laughs> uh, 
He says, my time is very limited, you know, since I have a job. Hey, I got a J-O-B too, it's just not that intense. Uh, it'll be, your guys will be seeing a lot less of me here in a couple months. Uh, tomorrow, I don't think so. I don't think you have to sign up for that. Um, work from home today. Uh, there it is. There it is. The the got the got the message. The Claire poster is out for delivery. Out for delivery. That's bull. I love lots of tracks. <laughs> I don't know. Every time I say something, I'm like, "Oh, I got the Nissan today," or I'm like, Ooh, "We're on this track today." Matthew Bird's always like, "Trash, trash." <laughs> it's good though. Well, I'm glad I picked a good one. I am. <laughs> Support me. Ah, <laughs> uh, where's ah? Uh, I can't wait till Poonam comes in here. I always have to think how to pronounce it. I always want to say Poon Man. I don't think <laughs> I don't think that's it. It is Poonam. I can't wait till Poonam comes back, and uh, everybody drops the <laughs> starts dropping the H U emoji. That's gonna be a. Uh, that's going to be a great freaking time. That's going to be so funny. I'm excited for it. You got me confused with somebody else. Okay, maybe I do. Maybe I do. Maybe I do. Uh, what's that? What's that? What's that? We got a notification. My phone gets so many notifications. And I don't care about any of them. 90% of the time, I need to clean it up. Hey, hold on, what? They can't talk in chat because it's subscriber only, though. Is my chat subscriber only? Is it? Oh, shoot. Let me flip that off. I had turned that on for a stream at some point. Let me turn that off. And I guess it copied the settings over. Let me turn it off. Uh, if I can turn it off during during the stream. If not, then I, we're just stuck with it. Uh, I don't know if... Let's see. That's true. That's true. If you want to chat, just sub. Uh, hey, look at that. What's up, Silva? Welcome, welcome uh, to the channel, buddy. Uh, yeah, I don't. I don't think I can turn it off during. I agree. I changed it. I changed it. Anyone, anyone can do it now. That's true. Maybe I'll turn it back on. <laughs> turn it back on. I didn't realize it was on. Bad idea. All right, I'm gonna turn it back on. Everybody, everybody who subbed, they are a uh, subscriber. You have to be a subscriber for one minute. Uh, actually, any duration. You have to be a subscriber. There we go. Hoi, hoi. Spam. Yash. Oh yeah, that's how we get yashes, isn't it? But however, we can't. It is fun banning them, so the uh, we are missing out on that. They could sub and then spam too. It doesn't stop the spammers. Uh, guys, the stream is at. Dude, my YouTube duties here. Let me check. I'm looking. 16 likes. If you were hanging out with me in here right now, hit that like button. That's how we get more people in the stream, more people to hear about us, and we get more people on the track, which is the real end goal. Too bad for uh, Poonam, though. Oh, yeah, we won't hear from Poonam. Maybe Poonam subscribed. I I have a feeling that Poonam has subscribed. She's been here three times. I just have the strange feeling that that she subscribed. My cat is just hates the closed door policy right now. He's out there beating on the door. Dad, let me in, you monster. 
Uh, okay, Casey. Five minutes to go. Five minutes left. Let's see if we can hear him. Let's go to webcam. Okay. Listen. Let me turn off my filter on my mic. Hold on. Filters. Let me turn off noise suppression. Okay. And we're listening. I don't hear him. He stopped. Of course, he would. He would stop. Honestly, my mic sounds better with the noise suppression off, but I leave it on because of the uh, the AC unit. We'll see how loud the AC unit is. I might turn that noise suppression off. I listened to it back to a stream the other day. I don't like the way it sounds. Okay. Anyway, he's done. He's done throwing a fit about it. Uh, back to garage, set up, put some fuel in this car. I'm not even gonna use quality fuel, I'm just fuel, I'm just using race fuel. I don't wanna forget again. We need a potted meat and a Claire emoji. I, I totally agree, but we need more members to get more emojis or we have to sacrifice some of the current emojis. Um, you know what I mean? So, like, as you get members, you're allowed more emojis. I think... Uh, oh, there's the AC unit. You know, the white noise isn't too bad. Tell me if that AC is annoying. It says it's coming through at 55 decibels, so... Negative 55 decibels. That should be fine to leave on, I think. Here's what it sounds like if you don't hear game audio. Yeah, so that's that's what I was thinking. I was thinking we would we would sacrifice the old man emoji, which is diabetes reference, which nobody gets anyway. Uh, we sacrifice the old man emoji, and we get rid of one of the flannels. Problem is, I added the black flannel for for um, Odd Beer. That is specifically was requested by Odd Beer, so could get rid of the red because we do have Bond to indicate being fast. Like when I'm fast, we can use Bond. Uh, because nobody's really using the red for that. So I say we get rid of the red flannel and we get rid of the old man. Good deal. I'm just going to leave that noise suppression off, though, because that because that noise suppression makes the mic sound ugly. Diabetes. <laughs> yeah, I know. that's. I put it in there because of that, but uh, nobody really that's uses it for that. They, they, they all use it to make old man references, uh, which is fine. Uh, I would rather have a... Uh, Thanks, it looks clear. I would rather have uh, the other emojis in there. The break temperatures are low. Definitely get a pot of meat emoji. We'll get we'll get that set up here. Thank you. Uh, you know I haven't, and I I need to. Um, right, I haven't had a flannel, and also we're getting into the months of the year where it's not appropriate to wear a flannel. So maybe I need to buy me a flannel T-shirt. I'll buy me some flannel T-shirts. Flannel cutoffs. Fourteen on track, guys. There's still plenty of spots left if you want to jump onto Zonport uh, and do a do a community race today. You're more than welcome to. Even if you're new here, go to the description of the video and the Discord link is in there. You can go to the announcements tab and you can join us with the information provided. Yeah, flannel vest. I'll get like a button up vest. I honestly need to go clothes shopping again this year for uh, my wedding, my like, filming weddings attire. Uh, might level up the uh, level up the professionalism in the outfit department for uh, shooting weddings this year. I might go tie. Might might put on a tie. Normally I go casual, you know. Um, and I've had people tell me they like they like the casual. I don't even know where I'm at right now. Okay, there we go. Um, I won't qualify, I'll just start the thing. Let's just hit this pit wall real quick and be done. Sweet. The, uh...
They have a running event, a 12k run, one lap on the track. That's the end of the session. And the back end. through the town of Zonvord. Oh, that's cool. Oh, that's sweet. So you've you've had your feet on this track. That's a neat thing to say. Uh, walked here. You've ran here. No, no. Yeah, typically I dress for my wedding gigs casual, but uh, I see some guys that are a little bit higher end than me that are doing just doing the the white rolled up the white button up rolled up sleeve tie with the suit pants and stuff. And oh, it does look good. It does look good. And then they got their little camera harness vest on and stuff. I don't know if I'll go that far. Up to a up to a marathon there. No thanks. Then you can blend in and join the dance floor. I'm already on the dance floor at weddings. With the camera doing doing this kind of work, you know? The angles and things like that, you know? I'm actually making a, uh, a wedding edit right now for a, a uh, 2023 recap. That's what I'm editing right now. I'm probably going to finish it up today. Uh, I had one of those, I had a, one of these instances today, or yesterday, while I was editing it. And the music I chose has like this, uh, it's like very violin oriented. It's very like cinematic and dramatic and stuff. And in the song at some point these noises start coming and they're like ha ah, ah, in the background it's like a violin sound and uh happy accident i was halfway through the video and i placed all these clips and there's a bride coming down the aisle in one of my shots and she says hi like she mouths the word hi to the groom as she's coming down the aisle but her mouth moves directly on that violin stab and it couldn't be any more aligned. And I, no, no kidding, I laughed so hard yesterday Truck editing that wedding. Editing that footage. 20 when it saw that. Happy accidents like that happen all the time. Uh, if she saw it, she would be like, oh my god, what was that? Uh, did you ever chime in with, uh, haven't you ever heard of shutting GD door? Oh, I never chime in. No, no. Um, no, and I never call, I never call, um, Groom's bride, uh, groom's bride. I never call the bride names uh, like whore either. <laughs> Wittavine in the 35s. Yeesh. Yeah, these boys out here are fast. Don't forget to hit drive. Make sure you have fuel. I'm going to check to see if I have fuel again. Okay, I'm good. I will not stop this race for fuel. I will not. So it's, it's the worst being taken out of a race for fuel trip is going crazy. You guys hear him now? He stops every time I every time I do this, he stops. Whatever. We need to follow car number 15. Oh, yeah, I'm not even touching the 36s. You got me there, man. I got some cleanup to do here. I'm not, I'm not super fast. All right, boys. 14 of us here. That's uh, that's good news. We've about halfway filled up the server. I like it. I like it. Already have a good race. I don't see any Jaguars out here. Uh, Strange love must, must not be out here. This new favorite car. Casey, can we brainstorm later about an idea I want to produce? I need production help. Oh, absolutely, dude. For sure. Go, go, go. All right, everybody. Here we go. T1. Zondvoort. Far left. Hold your line. All stops so fast. Still there. Hold your line. Still there. I stuck to the inside line. super Clear hard left. there. Someone in the grass behind us. Let's see if we can block that inside and get out. Very nice. Well done, Casey. Good start. I 
gotta be easy on the throttle out of that corner. For some reason, it's just like the slippiest thing ever. We've got here in front of me, Brooke in front of me, Sullivan in front of him, all fast fellows. Maybe I can learn something from their lines, not from that line. That's not one I should learn from. Is he gonna get back on track right in front? Where's he at? Okay, he's gonna be behind now. I could learn something from Sullivan though, for sure. They have to lift there if they're doing a late turn in. No way. If they're not, that's interesting. Well done, Casey. You're looking really good. Come on, keep your focus. Keep oh, Jim, thanks. Doing after this, Jim. turn is flat. I hear people say that. I just don't know how to get the line. Even if I chuck the car, I can't get it to rotate enough. I don't, uh, I don't understand. I need to learn how to do that flat. Oh, how did it turn around like that? He's leading the race. Oh, that was Winnevin! One of our leaders has spun out! is doing a last to first challenge. He's in sixth right now. He would be on us in no time. I gotta learn how to do that last turn flat. No clear. It's no clear. Is it flat in the knees? Dude, my lines are so bad right now. Oh lord. So here I am. I'm gonna hold it flat. I guess an earlier turn than that, I had to lift. Green flag, sector two, E3. Catch me if I keep running garbage lines like this. No doubt. Just take the photograph starts. Okay, okay. Oh my gosh, my breaking points and lines are so bad right now. Oh my god. I'm aware of it too and I can't seem to fix it. Okay, well that's not gonna do it. Okay. That's 15 minutes. Jesus. Excellent, mate. Right. Keep it up. The gap to Sullivan. The head is increasing. It's now 5.3. The guy behind has just done it. 137.07. How's he have That's got to be him. God, the amount of speed he gets on every exit is just on a different right level, side. dude. Clear right. 
Come on, Casey. Don't let him get away. His exit speed is unreal. Like, you can be fast in a corner, and that dude will still pull up on you with a half second. Oh, I forgot the room. Okay, for it. Your front brakes are pretty hot now. So bad. It's now about 1.6 seconds. Yellow flag. Oh, 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 oh. I had to lift like crazy. I don't know how to get it. Uh, what FOV is this set to? I don't know. I don't, know. I don't know how to answer any of these questions. I can look after the race. Uh, I always like to tell people to ask that question. Uh, it's set to comfortable. That's what it's set to. Uh, but I will give you an exact number afterwards. The guy behind you really went. The gap's now 1.1. Go. Thank you, Jeff. Thank you for getting me there. <laughs> Your right temperatures look good. So tomorrow is the test run, Jeff. What time are you doing that? I, I need to just look a look at your Discord, but you're here now, so... Hold off the monk. The monk behind me. Monk. Gaining every second.
Carbon says, can these server races be any later in the day for us UK people? Um, well, I'll just tell you, that's what you got Jeff for. That's what you got Mr. Uh, Jeff TSC there for. If you, if you don't already, make sure to join his channel. I actually can't do much later later in my day because of just uh, stuff I do for my business and um, then family time cuts into it. So, unfortunately, and what's funny is most of my audience is UK. Very, very few of my audience are uh, American. Because most Americans are working, working away right now. It is, uh, for me right now, it is like 10 a.m. All right, Casey, don't let this guy distract you. If I streamed like prime time, you know, for like uh, racing in America, it would be middle of the night for you guys. If I went live at like 9 p.m. here. That's what you got the Sim Cafe for. I ran wide. Mox saw it too. Left. I won't Clear allow left. it. No. Giving Mock a hard time here. Mom. Won't let you through, buddy. People. And I won't give him the additional power of saying his name correctly. I feel that if I fear that if I say it correctly, he will gain extra power and he will fly by. Understand this corner. Never have, never will. I won't run wide again here. I'll protect the inside. Oh! Make is out! Okay, Casey. You've got half your fuel left. What happened? He's probably why are you so slow here? Gap two. Sullivan in front is now 13 seconds. There's no chance of catching Sullivan, but we can try to hold off Brooke. But yes, Carbon, uh, yeah, Jeff's community is a lot like mine. He does these uh, community races. They're even a little bit more organized. He'll, uh, he'll have them posted what the races are going to be. They're like 30-minute races. They usually end with a uh, Porsche Cup. Porsche, Porsche Cup. Five minutes remaining. Five minutes left. The last lap was at 138.90.
holding our ground. Gained some time on Brooke there. Oh, what happened? Why did okay, I Casey. Cup chance for the system. Oh. Took a little bit of sand there, so it's good. two corners to catch me on, it's definitely these two. I still don't know how to take them. That's pretty good, actually. I like that one's good. is back, back from the dead, fighting his way past Brook right now. He will take me in the next two laps. No. He can't allow it. There's no not allowing it. He's just going to get by. He's incredibly fast. I don't actually have a line through these turns. Playing defense against the guy much faster than us. Here we go. No way he doesn't get by me on these two turns. I'm so slow here. Nissan, go! Nissan, go, go, go! One more lap to go. Defensive drive on our hands here. It's going to be hard to hold them off. <laughs> oh, it's a slow exit. He's going to burn me here. Oh, no, he got aggressive for it. Wait up, buddy. Right. I'm gonna I'm gonna wreck somebody now. I'm Clear going too around. fast. Oh, okay. On Come left. on. Sorry about that. Hold Is that me? Yeah, left. it's me. Tied up. We all got tied up. Good race, some boys. Good race. Whitavine, you are way faster than me, though. The uh, so uh, I was just being as defensive as I possibly could.
brace, boys. Jay and uh, Cooper had a great race. Mate. That was your day over. I have to admit, Wittavine, I made you. I made you think you had the inside there. I definitely left a lot of room there, and then I tried cutting it off. I think a little bit too late. Um, guys, also, uh, quick talk, real quick. How many we got in here? How many? We have forty people. Hey, thanks for hanging out. Uh, we have 12 on track, which means there are still a lot of spots left. There's 20 spots left if you guys do want to get in. Uh, yeah, I hit you, uh, Mank, after our, after me and uh, Wittavine's uh, collision. So, uh, sorry about that. <clears throat> anyway, as you saw Mike post today in Big Event Info, we are planning it. Uh, in the next couple days, we'll have more info. I would like to get another big community event in before my wedding season starts and before I start really getting busy uh, because Saturdays and Sundays will pretty much be clogged up for me for most of the year. Um, there will be a couple off months, so that's good. But uh, we are looking to do uh, our next big community event and it is going to be a uh, team race. You are allowed to do it solo if you want. Uh, we're, we're thinking um, like a four-hour race where uh, everybody, uh, one hour and 10 minute stint timer uh, you can do it solo. You still got You still have to drive through for the stint timer, um, but yeah, I think we're gonna probably do four hours and uh, teams of two. That's what we're looking for. Teams of two. Like I said, you can do it by yourself if you want, uh, but it, I can tell you it will be way more fun. Um, will be way more fun with a uh, with a friend, and we'll be getting that worked out. Um, more info coming soon is what Mike says. Uh, we were talking about it last night, late last night, way too late. So got to figure out what the prizes are going to be. Um, I'm going to do it differently this time. Uh, I've seen what Jeff's doing. I like that a lot more. Uh, we're probably going to move away from um, giving monetary prizes out to first, second, and third. And I think a some sort of trophy or some sort of recognition is nice. And then there will be um, participation prizes given out after. So if you if you stay for the whole race and you cross that finish line, you and your team, um, your name is put into a, a pool and we have a drawing uh, for stuff too. That keeps people in the race, keeps them engaged, and hopefully keeps us having a good time. And that way it's not as much about place. So when things go wrong, people aren't as hurt about it. Because um, ideally that's what we're here for. We're here to have a good time. So we will have some something to give out to our podiums, uh, but then we will also have monetary prizes of some sort for uh, if you cross the finish line, which I think is a way better setup anyway. So kudos to Jeff for showing me the way. Uh, yeah, I thought about that too, Collabra. I was thinking about that this morning. Um, we could definitely give, uh, we could have a special Discord title, things like that. Uh, but I want, it, I want it to be a little little bit more valuable than that. I love those trophies Jeff, Jeff has given out for his... Uh, his cup, but I don't know if one community race is. I feel like the the whole cup series thing makes the trophies like like that's a definite. But for like a a one day off four hour race, I don't know about like the shipping and all the stuff that goes into getting those trophies out. Um, yeah, the the P one takes home uh fifteen cans of potted meat. Uh, Jeff is currently stroking them right now. <laughs> that's good. I'm glad. I guess I'm glad. <laughs> Happy for you. Chuffed. Chuffed. Uh, but yeah, I am excited for a team race. Uh, ooh, now the saucy part, whenever it comes down to it, who's going to be my teammate in the uh, Road to Racer race? I feel like it's going to be, it can't be Jeff. I feel like it has to be a Road to Racer community member. Um, Yeah, yeah, so first place gets, uh, sorry, polishing, not stroking, polishing. Thank you for clearing that up. Oh, my foot cam. It fell. You can't see it. Uh, let's see. We got one more race left here on Zonboard. Guys, there's 11 on uh, track right now. There is definitely room for you if you want to jump in. Uh, been good races so far today. Good races. I have shaved a little bit of time, but I'm not getting much better. The uh, I've been trying to focus on a couple corners, and uh, they're just tough. They're just hard to, hard to understand corners. Um, that would be on the screen. 
that would be this guy. Uh, I want to say, hold on. Here's the windy straight. Yeah, it's this guy right here and this guy right here. Both incredibly tough corners. Knudsen. Nah, nah, I won't pick Knudsen. I won't pick Knudsen. Um, we'll see. We'll see. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. I think the trophy is a bit much for a single event. So I'll, I'll figure something out. Um, we are going to have to tone it down on the monetary value a little bit. I think the spa race, we gave out like almost $200 in prizes, like in cash prizes. I don't know that that's doable at the moment. Um, but I, I would like to give out something physical. I don't know. I'll figure it out. Pot of meat's a great idea. though. It's dollar a can. Uh, Wilson could be good. Yeah. Wilson could be my, Wilson could be my partner. Um, I know Travis Bartlett has showed interest many times of doing a, a two man race. It's been very, always been very supportive of the channel as well. Um, I'll get it figured out. Candy. We could give out candy. Is there anything I can do on here? What is this? Interesting. <sighs> oh, I need a good stretch. I haven't been sleeping good the last few days. I don't know why. I don't know why I just go to bed. I just lay there for two hours and it takes me forever to fall asleep. I don't know. Uh, never wanted to win a race more. Are you talking about the trophies, Jeff? The trophies? Oh, waiting on emails. Still nothing. Okay. Oh, let's see. I can make something on my lathe mill, a little plate or a or a wheel design. Oh, that's interesting. I have rabbit stew plans. Okay, we're not we're not selling off bond as a prize. That's not um. Uh, nobody gets the rabbit. Oh, I didn't see strange love says winner gets bond. Oh, okay, now I see. I see. I see. Okay, Jeff, you're a monster. No. Um. Question, Jeff. If you won and the prize was bond, would she need to arrive alive, or um? This is a dark question. Would she arrive alive uh, so you can do the honors? Or would I just have her put down and put her on ice and then you would receive the, the rabbit? Dark question, I know. But I feel like you have a dark answer. So I figured I'd just ask it, you know. I'd be happy with a foot. <laughs> Yeah, no, I'm not. Even if even if Bond passes away, I'm not sending you any part of Bond ever. You never get a foot, nothing, nothing at all. Well, I had an odd beard. I stayed up too late playing eye racing, and then I couldn't sleep. Uh, let's see. Oh, but who said that? Uh, Mank says I can arrange bobbleheads. Oh crap!
I already see my friends right now asking what the heck is on your dash. I'll just point out and say, that's Casey. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Would be neat to have a little, like, uh, a little bobblehead with a human body, but, like, uh, a, di a car, a little car on its head. Just a car for a head. That'd be cool. I spark an idea. Uh, oh, he knows a shady bobblehead dealer who hangs out under the London Bridge. Okay. Sounds like a good idea for merch. Right. Guys, I'm not going to lie. Merch for me is like a really simple thing. Uh, it's just a site called Stream Elements. You don't, I don't like, I don't have to ship, maintain or anything. I just, they just print them and send them. I don't ever have to think about it. It's really nice, but it's limited. They don't have bobbleheads. <laughs> that sounds like a lot of work. Okay, now we're just getting crazy. If we don't need bobbleheads of me floating around out there, I don't like that. You got to get the nose right though. Get the get the get the beak. Get the hawk. The hawk beak. Make sure it's right. And don't make my forehead bigger than it already is. I won't stand for it. I won't stand. Don't the hairline. Don't do my hairline any farther back than it is. If, we're, if you guys were in charge of making the bobbleheads, you guys could really do me dirty. You know that, right? You know it might be a good idea to do the bobbleheads as me because I'm I'm sure it'd look hilarious. You have the right artist do it. Oh, it is raining 30, but I don't think it'll make it here. Interesting. Drive the car. The track temperature's decreasing. It's now 25 Celsius. I'm gonna do some research. Give me, give me some time. Make, how do you, how would you even do? Wait, hold on. That's the end of the session. Make, what did you say here? Hold on, I'm doing some googling right now. For uh. We're getting deep into this now. Can't ask for it. Matthew, I only planned on one more race. Are you making it in? P5, 20 minutes. Oh, he's in here. Good deal. He's going to make a race. Good deal. Oh, it's raining now. Yes. Oh, we're going wets, boys. Get the wets on. Oh, this is exciting. Uh, wets. Uh, oh, God, tires. The track temp is 25. The air temp is... 19 Celsius. Oh boy. We're just we're just jacking them up. I don't even care. I don't even care. We're just jacking them up. Seven point. Oh, okay. Uh, you know, I honestly, I said I'm kind of close. I wasn't too far off. You know, I'm starting to get the hang of this crap. All right, let's get it. Uh, current setup, fuel strategy, forty-three. That's good. Back, back. Oh, guys, I'm excited. We get a little rain. You know, I've come to like the rain now that my game gets so many frames. My frame rates are so high, and my twenty-four hours in the Nords gave me a respect for the rain. I actually am a big fan. Follow car number 79 in the left column. Go, please go. There we go. 
I have not driven the Nissan yet in the rain. How fun. If there wasn't ghosting in ACC, do you think people would be capable of doing a clean double file? I feel like the double files are so sloppy with the little mini game thing. I guess they would have to. They just have to get good at it. Go, go, go. Oh my gosh. Clear left. Clear left. Strange love, you're so slow. Go. <laughs> oh, in the rain. Ooh, free wide. Still there. Still there. That was, that was sketchy. I almost messed up. Left side. Hold your line. Hold your line. Trying to give him room, trying to give him room. Very nice. Line. Good too wide there. Clear left. That was very good. Oh, everybody's like, oh, you can't do it flat out? <laughs> that was crazy. I saw everybody float over the hill and kind of readjust their way of thinking. Accidental dive. Accidental dive. I'll take it. Left side. Clear left. That curve there on the inside, that curve might be dangerous. Maybe not take that. Alright, just like that, we come out P2. Spot on, P2. We're expecting medium rain in the next 30 minutes. Oh, look at Mr. Bird coming in for his uh, his race today on stream. And holding a P1. Oh, no, no, no. Stewart's a warm Car right. We're going to get back on here any second, yeah, right after this part. Right. Go, go, go. Green flag, you're clear of the incident. Right side. I don't want to go too wide. I don't want to. Thank you. Thank you for back. Best lap right now. Green flag. Guys, the number's purple. It won't be for long, but it, it was. It doesn't happen often. No traffic, it'll go out this lap. Oof. 
Beck looks ugly. He's up the hill. having a bit of a tough time. Normally a very fast fellow. Green flag, you're clear. 15 minutes left. We've got cold tires. We need to get some heat into them. There's an advanced line I would recommend. We're going for it. We are taking a little bit of that curb over. Switch it, or is this just weather random? Mike might be in here racing. He is. I'm like, don't answer that, Mike. The captain raves. We didn't Nine restart, so honestly, I think it was seconds. just random. It's very rare that we ever hit the random factor. It's cool. We got 13 minutes to close this gap. Green flag, you're clear. disqualified by race control. Sector 2 is clear. Was that a manual? Uh, was that Mike disqualified or was that just the game? Sullivan is having a great race up there, it appears. Cooper. Who needs to go? I hope to join in here in a couple laps. I feel like I, I have the pace to catch. Maybe not Sullivan. Maybe Sullivan is traffic right now by Cooper. Okay, Casey. The next car is Cooper. just said in game chat they have a yellow engine oh there's my chance there's my chance we got Sullivan sector one is green it's gonna help me close a little bit of a gap here but oh, that's Cooper Cooper ran wide
some good lines in there, too. You've got ten minutes left, ten minutes to go. Focus on the exits. We can go faster here. Half distance, the fuel looks good. Slowed down a lot for this because he missed it last last lap. Took it very cautiously this time. Can't catch him. Ah. Got to. Is now 0.9. The lap time was at 1.45.50. Couldn't quite see my braking point through the mist. So I did miss it a bit. Catch these guys. a little bit too much that time. Oh, no, Cooper, that's it for me, buddy. I went way wide. Just a little bit of time there. Head is increasing. It's now I didn't save it. It's not terrible. to push now and it's getting me nowhere. I need to go back to just being consistent. Lost a whole second now. myself a nice gap here though. I got 14 seconds behind, a few seconds in front.
minutes left. That feeling is not fun. down 144 yet, which I haven't even touched, so he's gone. That's half fuel. You've used half your fuel. Go, please. No, no. I think the timetables have worked themselves out. This is exactly where I'm supposed to be. Like some good races probably going on behind me, uh, both about a second apart back there. Just sent me something. Saw the corner of my eye. Look at that. Two minutes to go. Two minutes. That was a cat. Oh my. Oh my, Joe. Now I see what that is. Ooh, it's awesome. Here comes Mank in the rear view. Payback for last race. He's like, I'm a lap down and you're dead, Earhart. <laughs> I wouldn't mind a racing partner. I'm going to slow down here.
deal with it. Right side, <laughs> clear right. There we go, we did it. We did it. Uh, what am I looking at here? All right, Casey, you picked up a bit of aero damage. Good race, guys. Also, Cooper, great consistency, dude. I could not keep up. Who we got in first? Matt Bird. He wanted a race today and he got it. Good race, buddy. How did how did Wittavin get DQ'd that race? Um, I want to see Cooper. How, how clean were they? Oh, invalidated Cooper. Weird. Invalidated the first four, and then you're like, oh, I got this figured out. Yeah, you pulled away halfway through. Uh, Mr. Sullivan and Cooper. Good race, guys. Good race. That was good. What's up, Snap by Dan? Oh, you went out on dries, okay. Go. Jeff, this is... <laughs> Jeff, it's wonderful. I, I actually... I prefer the silence. I think it's awkward. And I think it's uh, terrifying. <laughs> I prefer the... Jeff sent me a video that's fantastic. It's not like edited yet, but uh, I kind of like that it's awkward. Um, it definitely needs the uh, it definitely needs some sound effects and music, but I like that it's so uncomfortable to watch. Uh, I DQ'd him as he was off track, giving the yellow. Oh, I remember that. I remember that. And then cleared it. Okay, that makes sense. You need like a, you need like a bounce, and then you need like a record scratch, just like that slows down, and then you need to be like dun dun dun. You know, you need like a, go all movie sound effects on it, Jeff. Uh, if that if that made sense, what I just uh, pitched to you made sense. Um, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. But baby, <laughs> oh my ear hurts. Ow. Oh, you ever, ow, you ever have your headset on your head wrong and you not realize it until the end of the day? As soon as I took the pressure off, it hurts like hell. You can't see that ear on camera either. You put, oh, it's so red. Ow. Is this one that red? No, eh, a little bit red. Oh, it hurts. Oh, you want? Oh, you want me to? I'll, I'll hook you up. I'll hook you up, Jeff. I have an art list. I, I got all the, I got all the sound effects and music. Uh, did I see you were racing in the drive for Dean, Adam? I am not. I would love to. I just can't. Uh, Jeff though is. Jeff is racing in that. God, I would love to. Yeah, I had to turn it down. Um. My wife leaves for uh, three weeks this this Sunday, so I'm spending Saturday with the family. Um, maybe I'll get on and donate or something. I would love to help out. Um, yeah. Oh, I've never had I've never had it though. Um, yeah, I've never had that pain. I just happened. I guess I just happened to sit the. I happened to sit the fabric right on top of my earlobe, and uh, it just accumulated. Uh, Snap by Dan says, has Jeff mentioned his GT Neo yet? <laughs> Jeff says, not once. Oh, that's too funny. 
uh, will you stream trackside? I just literally won't be home that day at all. So, um, I would love to do that though. I actually, I actually would love to do a, a charity stream like this year sometime before the year's over. I think that would be great. Um, have you said, yes, I, I have talked about our next big event. Um, I talked about it earlier that it will be a team race. Are we looking at four hours, Mike? Four hours, you and a teammate, or, or by yourself, hour and ten minute stint timers. Uh, we were talking earlier about what our prizes for first, second, and third would be. And then, and then there would be cash prizes if you, if you cross the finish line randomly given out. Um... Adam, awesome. Just keep following the Discord, Adam. Eventually, we'll post something in there. It'll probably be later this year. My wife's been really excited about that. The day that the channel launched, she was like, um, she was like, oh, does that mean, does that mean, like, you will have the ability to do charity events? And I was like, well, abso absolutely. I would assume. So, uh, yeah, so we've been looking forward to that for a while. So we need, okay, guys, for the... For the community event, the little mini endurance team race that we're planning, our next big event here at Roads Racer, what track are we, uh, maybe I'll put a poll up on, uh, on Discord for what track we want. Um, me, honestly, I'm going to leave Monza out of the mix. I just don't want to do Monza for four hours. Uh, but I will put up everything else. We just did Spa, so I'll probably leave Spa and Monza out. And I know that I've just cut out the two most popular tracks in the game, and maybe it'll just be a Nordschleife, but... I, want, I think I think a smaller track would be better because I don't plan to have if we're doing teams of two I don't the Nordschleife I feel like you'll never see a car so let's do a poll Daytona has my vote vote okay Daytona is which which one is let me go over to ACC hold on let me pop over to game I don't know what track that is is that Kota no no that's that's circle also, rain race was fantastic. I love, I've, I've officially grown to love racing in the rain. I would assume we'll do GT3s, but a GT4 race would be fun, especially if we were on a smaller track. I think that'd be great. Um, let's go uh, single player. Which track is Daytona? Is Daytona on? Oh, yeah, Daytona's not on here. Okay. Kyalami Multiclass. I like that. I Yeah, I, I don't know. I don't know if we'll have enough entries to do Multiclass. Oh. Oh, okay, I'm a strangelove. Hey, Mike, let's make it Alton Park or Donington. Let's make that our poll. Alton Park or Donington. I think those are great short tracks that would be crazy to do four hours on. Um, especially with teams. Let's run the let's run the poll for Olten or Donnie. I think that's a great idea, Strange Love. Small tracks, tough overtakes. There won't be a lot of traffic, so those tough overtakes will be good fights. I like it. Yeah, run that, run that. I'm good for all four of those. Let's run that poll. That'll get us our track down. Then we'll come up with a day. Um, we don't want anybody getting a mental rest. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's go to... Get my calendar open. To verify this with the wife as well. Um, the Mac here. Okay, so I will tell you that my wedding season starts May 18th. May 18th all the way to June 29th. I have weddings every single Saturday. Yeah. 18th to the 29th. I have a wedding every single Saturday. I have nothing in July and only one wedding in August, but I will be catching up on editing for probably those whole two months. 
And then I have another like eight in a row in September and August, eight Saturdays in a row. So uh, right now I'm looking at May 11th would be an excellent day for it. How are we uh how are we feeling about may 11th it's a saturday we could also push for a sunday i mean like i could do a sunday race i typically day after weddings i sleep in and uh i do some editing on sundays but it, I, my sundays are completely open too so if a sunday's better we can always do that as well just bring the rig to a wedding every uh man will enjoy it you know you grt and you're not wrong you're not wrong. I can tell you that one of the big things that sells me whenever I do like wedding calls and stuff is I always talk to the guys about drones and stuff. They just, guys are just like, we're just kind of duh. You know, I just, I just say, oh yeah, you guys, uh, you guys know I bring a drone, right? And the guys are always like, oh, you do? Uh, yeah. So we're kind of, we're simple creatures. Uh, okay. Okay. May 12th, uh, question mark, TC first dance or on Saturdays. Let's go for May 12th. Yeah, that's right. We don't want to cross over. Uh, that's actually perfect. Yeah, we're going to go May 12th. I'm going to put it in my calendar right now. Okay, I'm going to put it in my calendar right now. We're going to do, we're doing the uh, next big Road to Racer event on May 12th. Thank you for that, strange love. That, uh, that makes a lot of sense. <laughs> and that'll be the big hurrah before i get into wedding season it's been it's been creeping up on us for a long time now road to racer big event may 12th that's what we're putting in for now You have a 24 hour that weekend, Mike. Okay, so if not May 12th, um, we'll see you. We'll see you, Mike. Adios, buddy. Thanks for joining us today. Good racing. Uh, Mike, what does? So this would be a week, the week after wedding season starts. Uh, but what does the 19th look like for you? I used to do wedding photography. Yes, I, I'm a videographer. I do uh, I do videography, cinematography, videography, whatever you want to call it. Uh, okay, I'm moving it on my calendar to the following weekend. Edit. gonna put it as May Sunday the 19th okay uh, so yeah it's not bad uh, snap by Dan the long days can be a bummer I'm paid well for it though I, I, I I'm paid well for doing weddings um, typically I sell eight-hour packages uh, and some brides do pay for extra hours, and some days I film for 10 to 12. Um, and, it, you know, if the wedding's three hours away and you're doing a 10-hour day, uh, you're looking at a 16-hour day before you touch your bed again. Uh, plus your prep time and all that stuff. Uh, but uh, but I can't complain. I get five months off a year. Uh, and, it, yeah, it's it's good money. So good money for, for how often I do it. If I were to fill up the, that off-season, I would make a lot more. But um, I'm very much a... Uh, good time over money kind of guy like i uh i could fill up my calendar like crazy probably and really make some bank but uh me i just i just uh just enjoy the time just enjoying life i didn't get to do that all through my 20s i spent uh my all through my 20s 10 years at a gas station counter working my ass off 50 to 60 hours a week or sorry 40 to 60 hours a week and i just i just don't uh i found a way out of it and i just don't want to do it anymore 
And also, that you gotta you gotta know, gas station pay was bad. I lived off some garbage money for ten years, so that proves to myself that I can live off garbage money. So I can book as little weddings as I want, as long as I have, as long as I'm making the gas station money, I'm, I'm living the life. I don't know. I guess I could be a wealthy dude if I really put my head down, but now where's the fun in it? I agree, time off is so valuable. It really is. And even though I'm about to get into wedding season, it's not gonna stop me from like doing things I still want. I just have to be a little more strict during the days, like maybe cut out my lunchtime naps <laughs> and then edit through those and you know, I'll find the time. Uh, if I really buckle down, I can finish a wedding in like three or three or four days. I can really knock it out. Really, if I was really, really strict this year, which I'm telling myself I'm gonna be, but I know I won't. If I was really strict, I would finish a wedding on Saturday and I would have it delivered or I would have it done and parked and ready to deliver by the time the next Saturday hits. But I'm normally not that not that strict on myself, and uh, I normally take about three weeks to finish a wedding. Mike says, there will be a sign-up sheet that people will need to fill out. Um, Steam IDs, car number, and car choice. Uh, Mike, do we want to do the same thing where they just we send them to their, like Jeff did, we just send them to their, uh, their lap screen page, and they just put in a time, or do we not even want to mess with that? Just let me know. Um, are we even doing like a, or are we even doing, how are we going to do that? Cause I guess it's team. So we're not, we don't need like, it's just going to be first, second, third. We don't need lots of different, I don't know. Right, Dan. And that's what I'm going to have to do. I'm going to have to spend the time that I'm streaming now, probably editing and I'm probably gonna go down to um, two streams a week. And if I do more streams, they'll probably be for an American crowd in the evenings. Um, probably like our prime time here, I'll probably be streaming like nine o'clock in the evening. Uh, once wedding season's over, I'll probably move back to uh, back to morning. It'll be interesting to see where the YouTube channel lies after a full year. I mean, we're coming up on, we're already coming up on next week is five months since I've been doing this. I've almost been doing YouTube for half a year. That's insane. I feel like I just started. Awesome, Mike. That makes it easy, too. Good deal. Hey, thanks for that sub. I don't know who that was, but thanks. Might have came from a short or something. A little shorty short. Nice, nice, nice. Um, don't kill yourself on the on the paperwork though, Mike. Let me know if you need help or something, and I'll buckle down one day with you and we can knock it out. Um, is there any chance we can make sure that there isn't a god team like Knuts and Mike? I think that that's a good idea. Um, but we'll figure it out as we go on. I missed that. Who was that? Someone subbed. I just missed it. Um, anyway, thank you for subbing. I saw it pop up. But anyway, that's it. I'm going to head out, guys. It is time to cut the stream for the day. Thanks for hanging out. I'm glad we talked a little bit about the next event. We are going to slowly keep working that together. Hopefully, sooner than later, we'll have you all the info because it is coming up in about exactly one month. Um... Oh, Mike says I have to drive with him in the AMG. No choice. It's a pretty quick team. I feel like that's a pretty quick team. Mike's very fast, and I'm generally fast. I'm not like... Uh... I'm usually middle of the grid toward the front middle to front uh but anyway i'm out guys i will talk to you later have a good day and i will see you tomorrow i hope to stream with jeff tomorrow i'm positive i'm streaming with jeff tomorrow but like i said his streams fall at the same time my daughter gets off the bus so it's like a weird time for me to stream because like she gets off the bus and yes i could go retrieve her and come back but she's gonna have stories to tell and you know you know you know it, she's got to have some attention so i don't know if i can't find a babysitter we'll see what tomorrow looks like so but adios, I'll talk to you uh, tomorrow probably, and if not tomorrow, sometime soon. All right, see you guys. Thanks for hanging.